what's good everybody welcome 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 back to my channel for the ones that are new welcome to nelly's tarot and more like share and subscribe so all your friends can find out what is good for the weekend of july 24 2020 how you all doing i'm so tired this week I've been doing laundry early. When I tell you early, I'm saying early in the morning. <laughs> Go to bed like around 3, 4 in the morning. It's, um, it's not so hot for the dryer. And like I wash towels every day. I wash, I, I do laundry every day. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Aries, you have two cards. One is talk to your angels. And your message goes, instead of worrying, ask for divine guidance. I'm gonna leave the link down below for the um, angels and masters link I cannot explain how helpful that website has been to me and I'm sharing I'm sharing it with you the link is gonna be down below the last but not least music And your message goes, your connection to music is healing for yourself and others. That's what it says for you, Aries. Now, we are going with Taurus. Taurus. What is good with you? For the weekend of July 24, 2020. Is it the last weekend of July? Are you kidding me? <laughs> no, I'm not kidding you. It's the last weekend of July. Okay, Taurus. You have, you are in the right path. And your message goes, keep doing what you're doing because it's working. Taurus. If you were confused, if you were doing the right thing, if you don't know, now you know. You know, you know. <laughs> biggie, biggie, biggie. I miss biggie. I miss Tupac. I miss Alia. I miss Lefty Lopez. Who else? Who else? Heavy D. I can't believe Heavy D. Michael Jackson. You know. Quite a few that I miss already. Gemini, you have heart's desires. And your message goes, the angels are supporting, guiding, and protecting you as your dreams become reality. Good for you, Gemini. Gemini, I wish you the best and forget about the rest. Cancerian, where is your card? For the weekend of July 24, 2020. I know I'm not done with, with individual signs. I hope I will. I think I will. Yes. Because then I got, and then right after I have to start with August. Monthly August. 
<laughs> is that my kids use the laptop a lot. And sometimes I'm like, yeah, you know, I'll wait for them to go to sleep and I'll do it. And I'll either fall asleep with them. Cancerian, you have creative expression. And your message goes, your soul longs to express itself creatively. Cancerian, do you check your monthly reading? Because he was talking about um, maybe a parent or a mother-in-law having a problem of how you, you know, how you make your living, how you portray yourself, whatever you said, that kind of, that's what, that's what it goes, my love, we kind of went into two together, you know, just, I just figured to tell you. Leo, what's popping with my lions and lionesses for the weekend of July 24, 2020? We should say the last weekend of July. You have, this is not the first time, Leo, you get this card. In my reads, it's not the first time. Because I call this the Dr. Dolittle card. <laughs> Animals. And your message goes, you understand animals and communicate with them intuitively. Trust your inner guidance as the animals are part of your life's work. That is so nice. I'm sorry. I I haven't had coffee in two days. <laughs> no, I think I had some yesterday, but it wasn't with organic milk. Then today I haven't had coffee yet. Should I make some? It's not too late to make some. <laughs> Here we go. What is popping with you for the weekend of July 24, 2020? Virgo! What is popping with you? You have study. And your message goes, reading, research, and education help you gain confidence and clarity about your career. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is up? That's it. I'm going to get my kids the melatonin gummies that they have to go to sleep. I'm going to give them to them at 7. <laughs> and once they all knocked out, I'm taking mine. <laughs> I haven't tried them yet. But Joseph, Joseph is the um, fitness trainer. He's always sending text messages. I remember him sending that in particular. Maybe he see a few of his <laughs> students online in late, late nights. It's okay. You know, sometimes I go to bed late. Cleaning. It's, it's like the perfect time. Kids are sleeping. Everybody's sleeping. Nobody's making a mess but the dog. <laughs> Libra. You have 
time to decide. In your message goals, make a decision based on your true... Make a decision based on your heart's true desires. I love it, Libra. Libra, I know you want... This is for my mama. I know you want to be here in the States already. I cannot wait. I cannot wait for those renovations in the house to be done. So we can pay you the ticket and you come over here. You don't need to pay your ticket, mom. You know that. We we having a plan that when the day that she comes, none of my kids are going to know. And then when she's, you know, like on her way over here, like she's, you know, almost here. Like her cab turning to the street. I'm going to say, I wish my mom could be here. And my kids are going to be like, yes, I wish grandma will be here. And then grandma's here. <laughs> That's going to be awesome. Scorpio. You have crystals. And your message goes, your connection to crystals and gemstones is a channel for healing energy it is Scorpio um I don't know was the birthstone for Scorpio but you should um just google it you know and then go to crystals and check you know all types all types there's so many types and and they're purpose for each stone is essential it's essential the day that I'm wealthy ah, I'm gonna custom me so much stuff with stones it's not even funny Sagittarius what is good with you for the week for the weekend of July 24th, 2020, the last weekend of July. Let's say the last weekend of July. Sagi. You have music. The music! And your message goes, your connection to music is healing for yourself and others. Sagittario, Sagittario. That is your card. Now, let's go with Capricorn. Capricorn, what is cool with you? For the last weekend of July 2020. I was gonna say Scorpio. Okie dokie. You have Capricorn Sky. No, no, Taurus. Well, this is Capricorn. <laughs> Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. You are on the right path. You had this before, Capricorn. And your message goes, keep doing what you're doing because it's working. It's working, Capricorn. If, if you had any doubts, I hope this card answer your doubts answer your questions answer your wonders now let's go with aquarius aquarius what's good with you for the last weekend of july 2020 let's do another one i need a 
a vacation out of the United States. I have a few places in mind. Aquarius, you have animals. Leo got this card. You have gotten this card a few times already. And your message goes, you understand animals and communicate with them intuitively. Trust your inner guidance as the animals are part of your life's work. That's what it says, your card. Let me listen. They might not talk, but their reactions, and you know, they, they all have feelings. I don't know Aquarius. I'm thinking maybe you're upset, and then your dog goes to you, and you know, it's like you have that eye contact, and something happens there that's what comes in my mind it had happened to me before Piscean where is your card for the last weekend of July 2020 you know who's here That's my dog. <laughs> Pisces. What is good with you? On the last weekend of July 2020. Piscean. What is good with you? For the last weekend of July 2020. There is no car for us for this weekend, Spirit. For the last weekend of July 2020. Yes, there is. Pisces. You have Builder. And your message goes, your innate ability to build and create brings a deep sense of a accomplishments I like the Pisces I hope it resonates to you now let's go with collective collective where is your card for the last weekend of July 2020 Collective, you have light and love. And your message goes, your purpose is to bring divine healing, light, and love to this world. I love them, my loves. My loves, this is all folks. Thank you so much for spending some of your precious time over here is greatly appreciated like share and subscribe so all your friends can find out what is good for the last weekend of july 2020 god bless you god bless you and yours take care have an awesome and safe pro protective yeah safe and protective weekend <laughs> my loves COVID-19 is still full throttle. Now Massachusetts is going to find people if they don't quarantine 14 days after they go out of state to those to these states that they that they're not doing good with this pandemic. Please stay home if you have to. Don't don't go nowhere that you can jeopardize your health and your family's health. 
okay it's very important let's just you know take it easy take care of ourselves and wait for this to disappear so we can all go out get out of the dungeons gather together and have a nice time get drunk you know few blades just wait for all this to be over so we can all come out when the coast is clear okay no drinking driving no texting and driving either take care see you next time bye